Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, bad, bad, bad days too. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Only been a few hours, but it feels like days. Only been days, but it feels like months. If you having girl problems, I feel bad for you, son. I got 99 problems, but Boom. a bitch ain't bust. I, I ain't saying she a gold digger. But she ain't messing with no broke, broke. That's how you feeling, that's how you feeling And I'm excited if I took comfort level While I'm drilling, while I'm drilling Fuck them bands, girl, me and you going for This is how I make non-toxic volumizing dry shampoo With rosemary, oil for hair growth I'm gonna tell you two of the most crucial tips to prevent hair breakage. The first one is to increase hair elasticity. You can do this by hydrating your hair every day. Personally, I like to apply a leave-in conditioner and a lightweight hair oil every night before I go to bed. This keeps my hair hydrated every day and increases elasticity, which prevents breakage. The second tip is to use products according to your hair type. This is what my hair looked like when I kept using the wrong products, oils, and treatments on my hair. And this is when my hair started getting better as as soon as I switched to using products for my hair type. So I put a lot of research, trial and errors over the years and I put it all together in a hair guide which has all the product recommendations, hair tips and routines for every hair type if you guys want to this is the ultimate eyeliner tutorial you'll ever need to see. You guys always ask for it, so here it is. I'm going to be using the Essence Super Precise Eyeliner, and I'm going to start off by wiping the excess off because we want to create really thin lines. Then you're going to rest your hand or fingers on your face. You can get a stable hand and draw a line from outer corner towards your end of the brow. For the top line, you're going to start from where your arch is and join it with the bottom line. Now we're going to fill in the gap, and then I'm going in with a concealer to really make the line crisp. To make this beginner friendly, you can map it out with a black eyeshadow first because you can remove eyeshadow much easier than eyeliner and then go on top with the eyeliner. Now let's start with the inner corners. I start by dragging out a line from the top lash line and then sort of make a triangle and do the bottom lash line like this. The last step is to just extend that top lash line and we're done. I'm gonna apply some mascara and false lashes and here's the end result. I hope you guys liked it.
my hair every day after using the Dyson Airwrap. My most frequently asked question is definitely about my hair colour. So I thought I would show you what I do in between going to the salon at home. I use the glazed conditioning gloss in the shade Chocolate Gleam. Starting off with damp but clean hair. As you can see, I'm going section by section and completely saturating my hair. I'm going from the ends and all the way up to my roots. Now we just wait 10 minutes and then rinse off with water until the water runs clear. And here is the after. Oh my goodness, it literally looks like I've been to the hair salon. The colour is so rich and glossy, I am honestly obsessed.